Hey, what's up YouTube? It's your boy Spookalai here, and I am here today with episode number four of our Pokemon Clover Nuzlocke. In the last episode, if you haven't checked that out already, you need to go check it out. There is probably going to be either a link to, the, to it, or you just go to my YouTube channel and check it out. But anyway, last episode, we went on a catching spree, and we got a full team of Pokemon. In between episodes, I did a little bit of grinding. I'm going to put the grinding at the end of the video so you guys don't have to sit through it at the start because I know I'm not exactly a huge fan of it, but still. Anyway, we got everyone up around level 9 to 10, uh, Carbomb's 11, and Cunt Punt is 8. But l let me let me go over this and show you guys. So we got Carbomb at level 11. He, still ha he has Tackle, Tail Whip, Ember, and Smoke Screen now. So pretty useful, could be helpful. Then we got Balls Deep, which I've been told by someone that a lot of people, this isn't an offensive Pokemon, it's just a lot of people associated with Gurren Lagann, which I can see why because of the drill. But he's got Horn Attack, Defense Curl, and Mud Slap. He learned Mud Slap. Next we got Coon, which the same person also told me that apparently Coon's evolutions look more like the fried chicken joke that it is. but. It's got Peck, Sand Attack, and it learned a Quick Attack. I think it learned Sand Attack too. I don't remember what it had in between uh, before I grinded, but. Then we got Wigga, the score rap with Tackle, Growl, and Sing. My girl learned Sing. She is putting everybody to sleep. She's like Jigglypuff up in this shit. And finally, we got Cunt Punt, who evolved into, what is this thing called? A Gusticoon. So. Gusticoon now has Tackle, String Shot, Stun Spore, and Harden. And I was told that it becomes a physical bug type, which is interesting. But it's just interesting. You don't see any physical bug types this early on, except for maybe Beedrill. But anyway, the goal for today's episode is to head out and go through Vidya Woods. So let's just head up over there. But yeah, I did a bit of grinding. I fought the Pokemon around here, and I also fought... Uh, a Pokemon around here. Piss off me, mate. Want to speed through that, but what I forgot to say now was. Oh, right, the Pokemon. Uh, they had some interesting Pokemon in this grass. They had a thing called a Larvatus, which is the Pokemon with the electric type attacks that people talk about. Are birds very important? Sure. Thank you. What happens if I say no? Thank you. Um, okay then. What the hell is that? Hi, Curacrawler. Hi, Curacrawler. You know what? Um, I'm going to switch... To switch balls deep out front, because I don't know what it is, but... Like, for all I know, actually... You know what? I, sh I, should, I should have car bomb out front. Because car bombs only weak to water and rock and ground, so the birdhouse is aggressive. What the fuck? What the hell is this thing? Birdhouse. Huh. Interesting. I can't catch it because it's not a. Uh... We already got our first encounter here, it was Cunt Punt, so... Ember? Question mark? Is it made of wood? What What the fuck is this thing? It's a birdhouse Pokemon? That's really fucking weird. Okay, whatever, weird. Hey, a potion, that's actually really useful, because I think I used a good bit of my potions. During grinding. And look, this is the Larvidus thing I was just talking about that had the electric type moves. It has Thundershock and Absorb. Which is uh, really kind of kind of scary in its own regard. Oh, I'm sorry. That that song is meme-tastic and I love it. Welcome to Vidalia Woods. I'll be your guide. Oh, I'm sure you will, bug catcher. What's your name? Bug catcher Rick. You got a cur crawler? My car bomb would like to say hello to it. 
burn through it. Mmm, delicious roasted curry crawler. Sorry, got to do it. I'm sure you're probably very uncomfortable about that, but oh well. Fuck the safe spaces. Lervatus? You know what? I'm gonna switch out to Coon. Mm, wait, has a lot of Uh, I'm gonna switch out to my, bo my girl Wigga. Wigga, it's time to bust some rhymes. Put this boy to sleep. I would have loved it if it just had like a rap beat instead of the normal sing music. That would have been hilarious. Yes. Yes! Break him! Mm -hmm. yeah. Stop bugging me! I know this was fucking dad joke. I, I don't know how the 4chan. Uh, okay, so I'm a Reddit junkie. Reddit has subreddits. 4chan, I think, has boards. I think that's how that works. You'll have to forgive me if I'm a horrible person for not knowing 4chan's basic aesthetics. I only know don't go near space dicks. You look weak, prepare to lose. How about you go fuck yourself? How about you go fuck yourself, sir? You only got two Pokemon. What you got? You got a square wrap? Guess what? I got a tackle with your name on it. Bop. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna switch out into my boy Ball Deep. We can just do slapping this thing in the face. I gotta say that much. I love Ball Deep. Not only because of the Pokemon, but because of the nickname. It's really good, actually. It's one of my better nickname ideas. Dunky P? What the fuck? Dunky P, Dunky P, Dunky P. Oh wait, is Dunky P... What is it? Oh, it's that thing! I forgot about that thing. Of course, it's a flying type. And it's got Peck. Well then! Slap it. And it's got Sand Attack. I remember this thing. Now this is that thing that kept spamming Sand Attack. And then I think it had like, yeah, it had small also. Fuck this thing, I don't like it. I swear to God, I swear to all that is unholy on this planet Earth. That's actually really sad. The poison is doing more than any attack, and because of the sand attack, I'm missing. I gotta switch. Uh, Coon, you want to help me deal with this? This thing with the quick attack. I'll say that much. Kuna is stronger than I thought it would be. Like, I honestly thought it would be pretty weak, but it, it's good. Like, he hits harder than I thought he would. Uh, do I have... I do not have any... I don't know. Do I have any... I have one catch of berry. I guess I should have saved... I should save it, but... Do I have any potions? Okay, I do have four potions. And I still have the Quick Claw, I gotta give to someone. Who should get the Quick Claw? I'll get, who's the slowest Pokemon we got? Who's our slowest man? Let's see real quick. 21, 16, 14, 14, 9. Cunt Punt is the slowest, but also Cunt Punt is, st is, a, is a bug. I'm guessing he's gonna evolve at like, like 10. And probably speed up, so I'll probably give it to Coon. That's really weird that Balls Deep is faster than Coon. Really weird. Curve Crawler. Dead. Huh, what's this? Ooh, free Pokeball. Sweet. Oh, and I also found this little guy, which is really cool. I think it's... I think it's just a normal grass type. But then I kind of looked into it at the wiki because I had to, I have to go to the wiki to get the sprites for the layout, and it apparently evolved as grass steel, which is really kind of cool. Um, you know what? Since Cunt Punt is closest to evolving because of those levels, I hope I'm gonna stick you out front. Her crawler. Just kill it. Oh God! Hi. Hi there. How are you? 
cockroach. We all, this is something I saw that I kind of wanted. I kind of wanted to get this because it looks really funny. It's called Kekroach, and it's got Astonish. Weird. Oh, you are not setting up defenses on me, boy. I'm about to break you. I said I'm about to break you there. Another Kekroach. Tons for. Potions. How much was. Oh shit, I should uh. I think I'm gonna switch. Heck it. There we go. Just gonna just peck these things to death and level. Sorry for the speed up, by the way. I just, like, if it's something pointless like that, I kinda wanna get through it. Ooh, a Tanga Berry. What's this? Ooh, a free potion. That's actually really useful. Um, I don't know how much it is. There. Uh, I'm really tempted. I might use this potion right now. I'm gonna use the potion right now. The birdhouse is aggressive! Oh god, whatever will I do against this creature of wood, made of wood? We'll go out into Ball's Deep. Hit you with this horn. Hit you with that horn. You cannot handle the horn! Ooh, level 10. Rock throw! Oh yes, please! I will take rock throw. That is a strong ass move. I'll be hurling all of these boulders. I wonder what the Pikachu is in this place. Would it be the Kekroach? I just like I just thought about that. Like you don't see Pikachu anywhere. There's, I guess the electric type of uh, Lavardus would be. I guess uh, Lavardus would be the electric type for this place. Fine with. Oh no. Even though I just that. Yes, thank you. Pikachu. Oh, well, I guess this is the Pikachu. What the fuck is this Pokemon sweet shit? It's literally just a Pikachu in a cotton candy thing. In a thing of cotton candy. What the hell? Got cotton spore. Oh god, that's actually kind of scary. Got sweets in. Okay, so is this thing just Pikachu with cotton candy in its asshole? How does this work? Are you just a pure electric type? Are you electric normal? Are you electric... Uh, like, it... When I think cotton candy and Pokemon, I think of Slurpuff. They're really they're just my favorite fairy type. I think of Slurpuff and I think of, uh... Swirlix, which are fairy type, but... They shouldn't have fairy type in this. Could they? I don't know. Let, let me think. This is Gen 3, so... Gen 7... No, they wouldn't be able to have... No, Gen 6, they wouldn't be able to have fairy type in this, I think. Then again, it is possible. I mean... Uh... Fairy types are in this game. Good to know. Thank you, Pika... Thank you, Pika, for telling me. <laughs> also, someone told me something interesting about the, that girl's design. Apparently she's a reference to a to a 4chan character. I just don't know off the I, I can't remember the full thing off the top of my head, so you'll have to forgive me. Uh, the male Lilligans has been the one giving me all these all these interesting little tidbits of information, which is really sweet, really nice of them. Uh, cause heaven only help me. I don't know I don't know enough about this. I have not dived this deep into the internet. I'm just gonna throw a potion on you, and I think we'll be okay. Hello, I'm a classic bug fan. Good to know. Good for you, buddy. Bug catcher Sammy. It's a Gustacoon. Hey, we're friends. Hunt, punt, kill it. Kill it. Kill it before it lays eggs. I will say that much. Gustacoon's got some good, got good defense, but like hitting hard is what I should be saying. Because two damage versus um whatever I'm doing to that one. 
do more than two damage by the look of it. Come on! I'm just gonna speed this up just a little bit. Whack! Steady whack! Birdhouse, I am going to switch to. Well, you know what? Balls Deep's got Rock Throw now. I'm gonna use Rock Throw. I'm gonna just kick this thing's ass with a Rock Throw. Birdhouse. This thing's so weird looking. Got tackled. Oh god! Whatever will I do? It tackled me! Tackle again. Oh, wow, I actually crit it. Not bad. Not bad, mate. And you got Gust. So that looks like it's it. Just tackling Gust. I'm okay with it. Ball deep. Why you gotta do this to me? Focus. Focus. Collect your chi. You focus. And, ooh! That was a lot of experience. Yo, I'm okay with that ball deep. You get all of that tasty, delicious XP. Um, I think we're about halfway through. I kind of want to go back. I'm gonna go back and heal real quick because I think we're only about. I think we're about halfway through. And if we are, I might end off the episode here. Well, you know what? It looks like uh, Gusty comes close to evolving, so I might. You can just find wild cat coaches, which is really cool. Can evolve? Oh, no, no evolution. Huh, must evolve at like level 12 or something. Can you please and kindly fuck off? God. So far, all in all, this is actually really fun for Pokemon ROM hack. Like, it's rare that Pokemon ROM hacks are get really good, uh are really good because sometimes they're just they're me they're, they go from mediocre to like bad like there's a few exceptions that break the rules and usually the ones that people work extremely hard on or like they really rethought how it is like pokemon sweet version uh pokemon uranium those are two that come to mind uh blaze like really pokemon rom hacks that are just good in general I, I, I get a gross. We're over the we're over the time limit, so what we're gonna have to do is end it off and come back next episode. So I hope you all did enjoy this little video. If you did, please make sure to go hit the like button and tell me something you liked about the video in the comment section down below. Uh, other than that, I don't really have much else to say. Other than I will see you all in the next amazing video, which should be up Friday. I'm trying to do Monday, Wednesdays, Fridays for a schedule. So yeah. I will see you all next time. And remember, you always gotta stay spooky. See ya!